Hey guys, welcome back to Train Sim TV. We're on Simrail today and we're going to do some dispatching. Uh, I say today, it is night time in the game, but it is still classes today, of course. So, um, we're on EM1. We're going to have a little bit of dispatching here down at Katowice Zawadi. Um, I hope I actually pronounced that right. So, the game time is literally pretty late on in the evening. I mean, it's, it's half past midnight when I record this, as it is the time on here. But there is still action occurring. So we do have a train due in a short while. We apparently have um, four, uh, sorry, one double four five, which is highlighted in blue, um, due quite shortly at a double o thirty eight. The time is double o thirty three, as you can see in the top right hand corner. So he's going to be coming in. He isn't due to stop here, as you can see on the layover time, it's at 0.0. .0. That means there's no stopping time. He is passing through and he's on his way towards Katowice. So we will be seeing him appear up on our computer screen on this bottom line very, very shortly. And we'll have him directed through. So this box is a pretty simple one. It's a, it's a difficulty rating of three. Although, however, it's not that difficult at all. I mean, there's a couple of lines going on here. Um, and since that, the last time I played this box, when it was in early access, uh, these two top lines, where my uh, mouse is currently highlighting on the two yellows there, you can't see my mouse, but you can see the two boxes highlighting, um, those were short. Now, I'm not really sure if anything's going to come in or out of this, so we'll soon find out. Um, so, here we go. If you see on my top right screen, the AI box currently at Sosnowick Glowney has in, uh, informed me that train 1045 has just departed. 0034 on track one so he's on his way and you can see now he has just appeared on my diagram on the bottom left so we're gonna double check what track and stuff we need to send him on so we're gonna look on this screen again um line number one is where he's going to be going um always check with this it'll tell you where it's going to be going so like so there's another one's here like 138 you look on here you that you then look for 138 so there should be something somewhere that would actually tell you uh now you have to have a little bit of hunting around for this, but you can usually find the line that it's meant to be going on. Um, he says, 138, where's 138? There's 138 there. That's that one. Even though it says 3138, it's actually 138 on there. So that would be where that would be going uh, if it was on that line. But anyway, for us, we want this one. So we're going to direct him straight through on line one, which is... This one here so you can see one two three and four so those are lines in the middle like number there as well so it's literally right up the middle anyway so he's getting towards the signal so we're going to start pathing him through so we're going to click the little triangle down here next to the yellow arrow indicating the line of travel i'm going to click the next one give it a train route and execute that so it's now drawing the path so he's now got the road to go straight through up to the station there but we need to continue that path so we're going to click the red a uh, little triangle that which is the next signal and we're going to link it up to the far right hand signal and then train route and execute again which now tells the driver he has a full complete path through our section now i think this is a bot driving this it's literally is all at this time of the day uh, is a lot of bots there's a few um players on here but there's not not that many at all this time mainly dispatches and a couple of uh, real drivers Recognize a couple of people. I know there's quite a few people that have been on it all day, but also a bit. I was on this at about two o'clock this afternoon. It is now half past midnight, and these people are still playing. So, the train is coming. We can see just over there. He's just coming around the bend now. Not due to stop here. We'll uh, we'll jump out and uh, watch it through. I'm gonna leave the box there. Remember my way around. It is a little bit laggy. I'm hoping that the video's not laggy. Now, Mark was having some problems doing some video um, stuff on here the other day. Um, I'm hoping for me that this will be all right. We've got a, a pendulum that's just come through there on the express working. The idea and plan of this is to uh, get a, like a screenshot of the box at some point with a train going past. Ideally for the thumbnail. Right, so. We need to tell the box at Katowice that the train has just gone through. So we're going to put 
Um, cat of it so train departed, which was one double four five. I'm not sure if it's um, an AI player or what a bottle or not in it. So we find out if we get a um, sort of an, a more human response. Usually, copy that. There's one that gives it away. Right. So that was pretty much on time, to be fair. Well, maybe a little bit earlier, actually. It would have been 0038 that should have gone through, but he was running a little bit on t uh, ahead of time. So we've got a couple of trains coming in next from uh, Katowice, which is our right hand side where we currently are. And um, we've got 4100 and also 42920. Um, 4100, which is the first one, has not got a, a stop as such. Um, but 42920 does have a short stop. Okie dokie. So, um, we've just been informed that train 24963, so 24963, which is this one, has um, been sent through. And he also does have a, a stop here. So, he's going to be stopping at platform one. So, that won't be too far away. That's only It's only around the bend, really, up there. It's a couple of minutes up the track. So, we can already see there's two trains coming in here. We've got two triangles lit up on the right-hand side. So, these are both coming on different lines through Katowice. So, um, until we see them pop off on this diagram, I'm not going to know which one's which. But, I'm going to set these points um, back. Just so they're all the right way. Don't really need them open at the minute. So this train's going to go across at the top, so right, what we got here? The bottom one will be the express, so on the lower line will be this 4100 most likely. Um, we then have 42920, which is due to stop at platform 2. However, uh, yeah, that is actually platform 2 is there, so he can go straight across. So we've been told... Um, so Katowice actually is a is actual person. I'll just copy that times two. <laughs> so basically, there's um, trains coming. So we've got these here now as well. So I'm going to send that through. So two four nine six three is stopping here for a short while. So we're just going to path him up to the signal at the station for now. We'll get his path set in a moment. Now, I don't know which... To be fair, I think that will be the pendulum coming through here. So, we're going to set this one now. Give him the full route through because he's not going to be stopping. And we'll send this one up to platform 2. So, it should tell us on platform 2, it should be line... F uh, it actually doesn't say what line, but... Platform 2. It's still telling me it's platform 2. So we'll set that to there, and that one there. So that's everything set. Now you can see that little green triangle on the right side has uh, stopped being lit up, and has now appeared on the um, actual diagram. So it is four one double O at the on this line here, which got us at the full route across. So we need to set that also to there, and there we go. He'll be here in a very short moment. He's going around that bend in a minute. So I'm, I need to try and get a screenshot. <laughs> so. I keep forgetting me which way I need to go out here. I want to try and get a picture of the box in there, but. It's not very well lit, which is the problem. Where the train lights the side of the box up is a totally different thing. She has done, actually. Pretty well. Although it's not really lit up that well. Right, I'll go back in here. Might have to do a little picture from here, to be fair, because it's very dark. It's not the most ideal of time to come and do signalling, but... Unfortunately, it's the time it, it, it fits around me. 
Anyway, right, so. 4 one double We need to inform Sosnoit Glowney um, of that train's departure. So, train departed. So, that's going to Sosnoit Glowney. So, we're going to click on here, train departed. So, we're going to put the train number, which was 4100, and just send that through. That just in informs um, the box that there's a train coming. Because they'll ask you anyway. Even though it's an AI, it'll still ask. And they just confirm that they've uh, basically received that. Excellent. Right. He is out of our way. Next, we will have uh, very shortly four, uh, 24963. He will be, I think there's a station somewhere around that corner. There's a station before he gets here. It won't be long before he gets here. Um, the triangle on the right hand side at the top of line 4 has just um, come off. He will appear on that in a moment, on that hood there. All sorts of stuff going on there. That's just glue up down the bottom. Not sure if I can get my uh, mouse to appear as well. Catch cursor. Does that work? Yeah, there we go. You can see my mouse now. Better. Right, so. He's just appeared. He's going to come across here and he's going to stop at the station. We will give him a, a departure time very shortly. So basically, you don't want to pass any trains out of the station until they've stopped. Um, correct practice is to give them the row when their time to depart basically comes. Rather than just give them the full route because otherwise they might not stop. So he's just arriving now. Little uh, two car unit there. Presuming that's going to be going off uh, the around the curve at Sosnock. I want to turn the lights up in it. It's a bit. It's, uh... Right, maybe put the lights on a little bit. <laughs> So it's just uh, stopped now. So that train is uh, 42920. 42920 is due off here at 47. So he's not actually due off for about a minute and a half. So we'll give him a road in a moment. We've also got uh, the other train that's just arriving uh, now over there. Again, there's another two car unit. So these will be I'll just come off that loop line. Uh, the two car unit usually turn off and head to somewhere I can't remember. On the other line. On the slower line. Another nice thing they've done is actually they've added an, a night toggle on the uh, screen. Although I'm more used I'm so used to it on this daylight one, I'm gonna leave it as that for now. I feel like I'm looking for things more. Right, so um, we're gonna check what this one is. So two four nine six three. So two four nine six three is this one. He's due up at forty seven as well. So we're gonna give him both the road. So top one is gonna go across down here, and this one is gonna go across to here. So they'll just set off any minute now. Roads are both set. The trains haven't just uh, quite got ready to go yet. There we go. So they're both off now. Time has just gone to 47. Excellent. So those have now both disappeared. So we can now let both boxes know of these trains departing. So we'll let Katowice know first because why not? Actually, no, we'll let Sosna know because I've just clicked him. So that one was 42920. 42920 was departed. And then the other one was 24963. 
24963 has departed. Excellent. So that's both of those um, gone. Both of those have been reported to respective boxes. One of them being an AI, one of them being a, um, an actual person on the box at the moment. So, Sosnoic Glown is a box I haven't actually um, opened yet. I'm still awaiting um, a few hours yet. I think about two hours game time before I actually open that one up. Um, I have done a fair bit of signal last couple, this last couple of days, so I'm hoping to uh, get some of these boxes opened up, some of these more bigger ones. Um, I had a go at Sosnoic Plodney as well. That's just around the back of the triangle curve, around the back of uh, Glowney. Quite an enjoyable box, to be fair. You've got to do a bit of um, swapping of tracks, like the directionality, with the other box. You've got to confirm with them, and they'll tell you if it's uh, safe for them or not. Uh, right, so we've got 24195 coming from Sosnoic Glowney. So, 24195. 24195 is this one, and he is not stopping here. He's going straight through. Shut these points up. So he's not appeared on my um, map just yet. But uh, he will do shortly. I'm assuming this might be a local hold one. He's not stopping. I wonder if I can get a screenshot just of the box in general. Actually, I'll, do you know what I'll do? Without messing about, I'll path this train through just in case he turns up. Because he won't, he'll, before I know it, he'll be here. So he's going straight through. So again, this, this box it, it is not hard at all. There's a few junctions and stuff around it, but I don't know if anything actually goes into these sidings or not. You can path things in, and I have done in the past myself on early access before it was released um, around Christmas time. I'm not sure if stuff's actually time to go into these uh, sidings. So, 24195 has just appeared. We also have another train coming in from uh, Katowice. Um, oh, hang on. Mm. So we've not been told anything yet of this uh, train's departure. He might not tell us, he doesn't have to. Um, it's just usual courtesy to at least inform fellow signalers of what's coming. So we need to plan for what's coming next. In theory, now I think it's going to be this one. It most likely will be this one. He does have a layover. Um, that's June at 56. So we can at least get the first part of its path ready because it's going to stop here. It's going to stop here for a minute. So he can't go anywhere until uh, he's going to stop here. So we'll come out here. Have another look out. I always get lost coming out of here. I totally forget that there's um, barriers right in front of the door. Can I get a screenshot? It's not the most inspiring of images, is it? <laughs> it's not very well lit. That's the problem. It's not very lit, but. In the ideal world, they would have done this in the daytime, but it's just a bit hard for me to do these videos in the daytime with kids running around. Yeah. Anyway, where are the trains? He's not in anywhere yet on the right hand side. It's still, it's still at green, so it's it's on its way. However, 24195 is very much almost upon us. So we should see him coming around that bend any minute. Keep an eye out. Hmm. 
Now this isn't going to be a long video of any means. It's just a just a quick look at uh, another box in the game. Um, this is just adding into the series of what Mark started. I thought I'd have a go, mainly to see how the video actually panned out because Mark's been having issues. So I wanted to try and do this video and see if we could do it without having any stuttering, other than the bit of the game lag. Oh, someone's talking to us. Five four one. Okay, it's five four one. What's five four one mean? Four oh six five oh. That was a local hole just going straight through. Going to let him know. Uh, that was train. Not lit up yet. <laughs> Can't see what it was. It's on the between paths. Oh, and what's there? Two four one nine five. So it's now gone out that green triangle. It's now meaning that the train is about to uh, appear on our um, diagram. So really, in the grand scheme of things, pretty simple, this box. It gets a little bit clustered sometimes. There's a couple of trains coming in at once on one side. You've just got to sort of look at the timings. Make sure you send the right one out first. There is also um, a set of barriers you can control here. Basically a footpath. And you can open them and close them. Um, however, I haven't actually done that yet. So that train is uh, on its way. So that was 4.0650. And 4.0650 is due to stop here. It's a PH, which is, um, means passenger stop. Does to be fair say platform two, but I don't really see what difference it makes. I'm gonna send it to platform one. I could have sent it up and back round, but there's nothing else due and there's nothing else in its way, so I don't see the problem with that to be fair. So this is a uh, four car unit. I actually got a screenshot of that train actually not put off by any actually there, so might use that as a thumbnail. If it was a daylight one, I could have done it outside. It's a bit hard to do it, you see, so I'm not gonna bother. I'm not gonna worry about that one too much now. Right, so he has now made his stop. So 40650 is due to depart here at 57. So we'll give him the road in a couple of moments time. Uh, Sosnowit Glowney has just informed that four, uh, 14143 has departed as well. Um, so we will be expecting him very, very shortly. He's just appeared upon the diagram now. So we'll give this the road so one four one four three one four one four three is this one here not due to stop it's come from warsaw that and it's going to bohumin 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 We'll send this one through on a full route there because nothing needs uh, stopping or waiting there. He's not going to be needing any paths that after a stop, he can go straight through. And we have another train coming up on the top line here. It's just lit up green, a little triangle. So we have a train coming up there very shortly. So what have we got? It appears to me that we have this one coming up next. Um... Which is Katowice. Going to Sabinli. Sabelnia, I think. 
And that's going on to line number 138. So post Sabalinia. I have no idea what that is. For me, these are the post AC, which that says Mais Lewis, Sosnowit. But it does say 138. So what? So it's four oh six fifty. He's asking what train. Even though it's the AI, it's asking what what train's coming. Basically, he wants to know. That's probably not been in it. But it's a reg. It's a reg working. Reg means I think it's regional. So you can find like train descriptions and stuff here, so it's this one regional. You can find all sorts of where it's what it's doing. There we go. The orange rocket's just gone through, I like to call it. Uh, one four one four three. That's letting him know, and then we have this one here, so we need to set him up there. It's just coming up to the signal. Yeah, actually, he's held the signal. I've actually held it there. It's good, it's a bot. So he's on its way now. That's just another little unit as well. I thought it might be local hold. But it turns out not. So we'll, we'll send this one through. And then we'll uh, wrap things up for this little short video. Just showing you how um, to operate the Ketafit's Zawadi box. Again, a fairly simple box by any stretch of means. We will have a look at some more intricate boxes in time. I am hoping to do a few more alongside with Mark on this little video series that we're doing. Um, I know Mark's been doing some of the stuff with the, uh, the, little, the more electronic panels. Um... I'll definitely have a go at some of them myself at some point once I've got a bit more knowledge behind me. And there's loads of boxes to discover yet, so we will try and get as many of these boxes in on as possible moving forward over the course of the duration. But so I'm I'm very happy and pleased with the updates that Simrel uh, brought since my last look early in the year, um, just after Christmas and a few months out of the game. I wasn't quite feeling it at the time, but um, I am a lot more happy with the game now. Um, it's a lot more enjoyable. Gonna path in. So let's see points are now changing and the route is now set. Oh one gone. I've actually set the wrong way. Maybe he's going that way. Right, okay, right, we just put them back. That's telling me it's wrong. It's four three three twenty. See, <clears throat> right? Okay. So, um, it must be that way. You know, it says Maslowitz. It's set. It's set. So it is right. I didn't think trains actually went down that way, but apparently they do. So there we go. It's told me it was wrong. It's nice that it's actually informed there because I didn't know that. Really, because that, that says to post. 
says Bellinia. That should really actually be on that on the left hand side rather than saying Meislowit. That really should be showing because that's the post. So that should really be showing on the timetable in my eyes. Makes it less confusing because I would not have had a clue otherwise. Right, so we've learned. So we now know something there. Just be aware of that because that, that, that's caught me out. There we go. And the train is disappearing. Whether you can drive that way or not, I don't quite know. But trains are going that way. But that was actually shut off on the... Uh, the testing at Christmas. Nothing was going off out of through that either. Right. Well, there we go. A brief little look at this box. We filled 30 minutes up just like that. We've, we had a few trains come through as well, which is nice. So it's not been a, a boring one. It's, uh, it's all good fun. Anyway, thank you for watching. Rather than me just dwindling on and talking. Um, don't forget, like, share, subscribe. Take another look at some of the other videos in the Simrail range that we've got. Um, there'll be more added to that um, as we go along. Don't forget to catch on Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash Trainsim underscore TV on a Friday and Sunday evening. Uh, varying from Trainsim Classic, Trainsim World and Simrail. Um, like, share, subscribe as well and uh, check out some other videos. Really do appreciate the uh, time that you give to having a look at those videos. All the best guys. We'll see you very soon and bye for now.